So in this video, you'll learn how to screen record on your Samsung Galaxy A56. So if you want to start screen recording, it's fairly simple. All you need to do is access the quick settings menu and look for the screen recording option. To access quick settings, you want to swipe down from the top right corner of the screen like that. And then in this menu, you want to look for the option screen recorder. If you don't find it, then you'll have to add it to this menu. And to do that, tap on edit and then select the quick settings panel. Look for screen recording in the list of available buttons. And then once you found it, just tap on it to add it to this menu. Once you've added it, just tap on done and then select done again to save and apply the changes. You'll notice now when you access the tiles, you can see the screen recording icon has been added. So from here, to start screen recording, simply select that option. And then from here, you can now customize how you're going to be screen recording. So you can choose to record sound, so you can select, set it to none, or you can choose media, or you can choose media and mic. You can also choose to enable or disable the show taps and touches. And then once you've finished customizing, just tap on start recording, you'll be given a countdown, you can just tap on skip, and now your screen is being successfully recorded. So every motion that you now do on your screen of your A56, as well as if you've decided to capture sound, will be recorded in this screen recording. You can go a step further by customizing what it exactly is going to be in the screen recording. So for example, if you look at these tiles up here, you have the option of adding text or just drawings to your screen. So you can just tap on that pencil icon like that. And then you can choose a different color and as well as the thickness of the pen. And once you've done that, you'll notice that you can now start just drawing or even typing on the screen. If you want to erase what's currently there, just tap on this undo button and it will go back and undo whatever it is that you've just done. Then to remove it, just tap on that pencil icon again and it will disappear. You can go ahead and also add a selfie camera preview on the screen of your, on the screen recording. So just tap on this uh, people icon here like that and you can see the preview here and you can see it's successfully using my selfie camera to record me during the screen recording. To get rid of it, just tap on that icon again and it will disappear. If you want to pause your screen recording, just tap on this pause icon and it will pause. So now you can just navigate through your screen recording without anything being recorded. So you can go do something private that you don't want captured in the recording. Then when you're ready to continue, just tap on start recording and it will start recording and you can even see the countdown underneath. When you're ready to stop screen recording, just tap on this stop button and then the screen recording will be stopped and it will be saved into your gallery app. So to view it, just navigate to the gallery and you can see your screen recording. Tap on it and then just tap on play and you can start viewing the screen recording that you had just captured. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below and we'll get back to you.